so I will, you know, you will be seeing me wearing this outfit twice. But I'll be filming two videos today. I have the house to myself. The kids are gone for a little bit. So I figured I would do my boxer that came today. Um, it is really beat up. It looks like someone tried to open it. It, it's in rough shape. So let's hope the products are fine inside because let's, let's face it, it's, I'm not even going to deny it. Bossy Charms customer support is kind of crappy. Yeah, so quick sneak peek. This looks, looks like everything's okay, but I'm not impressed. So there's a card. What's the theme for the month? Dare to Dazzle. As always, I'll put the prices on the screen so I don't waste everybody's time. So I'm going to assume these are a bundle. Vitamask Sustainable Glow and Nourish Masks. One is Flower Nectar and the other one is Juice Berries. And I think that's pretty cool. It says that the masks are actually biodegradable. So it's interesting. I always love sheet masks. They're my favorite to do. Um, the kids look at me like I'm insane, but let's face it, they're making me age like crazy. And next month I turn 30. So anything that can keep me young, I want it. <laughs> All right, next up is a palette. Beauty OPV Beauty London Spotlight Eyeshadow Palette. Um, I'm not going to open this just because I am trying to get more put away for my 200 subscriber giveaway. But I will find a picture and put it up on the screen right here of what the palette looks like when it's open, okay? Next up is True and Luscious Flower Dose Plumping Lip and Eye Serum. Um, it says that it's a hydrating plumping serum, but it makes me wonder, like, cause you know, like when you have a lip plumping and it has like that menthol thing, I wouldn't really want that around my eyes, but let me see if it says, say mentha. So I don't know, like really low on the ingredients. So I don't know if there is like a menthol base, um, product in here, but it would always be good for the lips. So a random sheet of paper. What the hell? I swear bossy charm is getting weird. A Luna Magic Vava Pink Lash Primer? Hmm. You know what? I gotta know. Is this thing pink? I do every now and then use lash primers when I put on my mascara because I don't wear false lashes. I know a lot of creators that do, but it's, it's not my thing. I know my eyelashes are short, but I can't stand lashes. I think the only time I wore lashes was on my wedding. Holy hell, it is actually pink. I, I wonder what the reasoning behind that is. I wonder if it helps the mascara. Let me see if this has anything on the box. Hold on. Nope, it does not. It doesn't really say anything. It just says all the pink in the ingredients. So I wonder if there's a reason why it's pink. I will have to try it out and report back to you, remember. It's really interesting that it's pink though. All right, and last up is my choice item. I will admit, I haven't really been excited about choice items lately, so I'm hoping BoxyCharm sets it up, but I do love pharmacy. And this is their Honey Grail Ultra Hydrating Face Oil. My skin is combo, but during the winter, because I live like 20 minutes from Canada, I do need a nice good moisturizer and even during the summer due to the combo skin on dry patches I do need like a light uh, moisturizer and oil and who doesn't love pharmacy's packaging it is just just beautiful so I think this is like the first time ever where I'm really not impressed with boxy charm I know it's $25 a month but this is the only brand I recognize um, I know that I don't like the sheet mess, but I'm, I don't know, I'm just not impressed. I feel like they could, they're, they're losing their, their own um, subscription boxes. So I hope next month is better for July. I did already make my July selection, but I will say once again, I wasn't impressed with the selections. So I don't know. It's a little bit disconcerting. It's like, what's going on, Betsy Charm? You've been amazing for so many months now for me. I just got it for Christmas, but I don't know. Maybe it's just an off month. 
but still for $25, it was a great value. So I'm not disappointed, like fully, like I'm not like, oh, I wasted my money, but I am kind of like, eh, you could be better. So I'm gonna throw that back. But if you guys haven't, please like subscribe. Once I hit 200, I will be doing a giveaway. I believe at the time of filming, I'm like 194, so I'm getting there. And I'm really excited to have that giveaway and celebrate. So let me know, what do you guys think of this boxy charm for the month of June? Yeah? You like it? All right, but until next time, guys, bye!